Hey, what's up guys? I have yet another Steelbook unboxing for you. As you can see, this is the, well, the 4K edition of uh, Rampage starring Dwayne The Rock Johnson. And I'll be honest, I had absolutely no intention of buying this. Um, in fact, I forgot it was coming out this week. And so when I pre-ordered this, I pre-ordered this on um, um, Sunday. And so I had to do a uh, store pickup because it would not have been released. I wouldn't have got it in time for like the week or anything. It would have been later this week. But um, I hadn't got, intended to get it because it looked like a dumb fucking movie. <laughs> you know, it's based off of, well, loosely based off of the video game Rampage from the 90s. You know, like the game with, um, I don't even know if you know, if whoever's watching this is old enough to remember that game. I don't even know. If there's been mil a thousand iterations um, probably since then. But uh, it's about... The premise, or if you'd call it that, the storyline is that there's three giant monsters, a King Kong type character, a Godzilla, and a, um, like a wolf, giant wolf man type thing. And they're just climbing skyscrapers and smashing them and smashing planes and stuff like King Kong. And that's, as far as I remember, that was the, that was the, um, premise. And I think you could play with two other friends and, um, just try to rack up the most points or something like that. I think, anyway, I might be forgetting... I'm misremembering that, but that, it's, that seemed to be the premise that I can remember. That was the arcade premise, anyway. And again, that's what I remember. I didn't play the game very much back then, but um, they made a movie off of that, and uh, here it is. <laughs> I have no idea how this did in the theaters. I think it did fine. I don't know what the like box office take was, but I'm sure it was fine. It's, it's uh, The Rock, so he's pretty much a draw. Um, anyway, let's get into this. I have the 4K here because... Um, honestly, I think it was it was twenty nine ninety nine, and the regular one, the Blu ray DVD one, was twenty nine ninety nine. So I figured, well, for the same price, I'll just buy the same one. And uh, if I want to, I can sell the four K or something. Or if for some reason, if someday I get a four K TV, I'll have four K stuff. But I don't see that happening right now. So anyway, here's the synopsis. If I zoom in, primatologist Davis shares an unshakable bond with George, the extraordinarily intelligent silverback gorilla who has been his care since he was young. When a greed-fueled corporation's genetic experiment goes awry, why can't it be like such a regular corporation trying to help the world? It's always a greedy corporation. Uh, George and other animals across the country are mutated into aggressive super creatures who destroy everything in their path. It's an adrenaline-filled ride. Davis tries to find an antidote not only to halt a global catastrophe, but also to save a gruesome creature was once his friend, starring The Rock and I think Naomi Har Nadine Har wait, yeah, Naomi Harris, I was right, and Malin Ackerman, I can't speak, Malin Ackerman, Jake Lacey, and yeah, Jeffrey, I thought Jeffrey Jim Mark was in this, Negan from um, The Walking Dead, and who's this directed by? Brad Payton, I don't, I don't recognize his name, so, anyway, let's open it up. I, um, I expect nothing from this film. It's just, you know... Skyscraper just came out last weekend, and it did not great. I think it only made, like, 35 million bucks or something like that on a $180 million budget. Oop, is that even stuck? Oh, there's one little piece of glue. <coughs> Excuse me. I like when they do just one piece of glue. It's easier to get rid of. Yeah, that's better. Um, and it had the side thing, too. Can see this is what it actually this is what it looked like when I had the thing on there. This is what it actually looks like. 4K. No 4K. That's kinda cool, I guess. And zoom. Okay, so there's the front picture of the silverback and uh, the rock. The uh, regular Blu-ray DVD version of this was like the exact same image. It was kind of weird looking at it. Um, except front facing. I thought that was kind of interesting. It's a picture of the gorilla behind the rock, and he's got like the same look on his face. So I thought that was funny. Like they literally took the same image, but just on a different perspective. That's interesting. I don't see any dents in the front or the top. Is there a spine slash? Uh, I don't see one. That's cool. And I don't see any dings or nothing on the back, so that's awesome. Look at that image, by the way. It's all of I me. Mean, there's the wolf dude, or whatever the fuck there. And then there's the uh, alligator slash Godzilla thing, and then there's George. George of the Jungle, or whatever. 
There is a Movies Anywhere code in here, and then what the fuck is this? Go to wvalist.community.com, attention to this code, it's for a survey. Here, you can take this if you want, I don't give a shit. It's for a survey, I guess. Excuse me. Here are the discs, here's the 4K Ultra HD, and then here's the regular Blu-ray, which is orange. And there's George again, fighting some police officers or something. It's kind of cool steel book, not bad. I think, like I said, the front image was the was the front facing one, and then the back image I think was just a picture of the the alligator monster thing, the dragon thing, whatever the fuck you call that, lizard. Yeah, I like this one better. Oops, excuse me. Rampage. I'll put this in here too, because yeah. Ooh. Okay, that's it. Very simple. Here's the, the back again. The special features quick if you want to see those. Not just a game anymore. Trio of destruction, rampage, production. There's actors in action, gag reel, lead scenes, and more. The usual shit. So that's it. Very simple. Thanks for watching, guys. Um, the usual spiel. Um, I'll have more steel books in the future. There's actually, I think, Ready Player One comes out next week, and then something else, I think, comes out after that. I don't recall, but um, I'll have more stuff to show you later. So thanks for watching, guys, and I will see you later. And that's all. <laughs>